Kansas City Chiefs opening possession of overtime have gone seven yards. Is this deja vu from a Thursday night game in Atlanta? Remember Kirk Cousins and the Atlanta Falcons got the won the toss and went motoring down the field and broke our hearts in overtime. We'll bring up second down and six bucks need us need a thrown for loss tackle a quarterback sack or something yeah. to keep this great kicker of the Kansas City yeah, Chiefs they, Butker out of field goal range. Need a momentum play. Grab that momentum back. Second down and six. The ball on the far side hash of the Buccaneer 43 yard line. Overtime drive started at the 30 yard line after the touchback. Mahomes will swing a tight end into the slot to the left edge. Snap belt high. Fire the pass far side. Caught ball. Missed tackle at the 30 to the 30 yard line to the 28 yard line. And the Chiefs are in field goal range right now. Yeah. Was it Josh Hayes that took a swipe? I believe so. Yeah, and he, he missed. came up and. Yeah, Hopkins was able to sidestep him, and it was Hayes. That's a gain of 15. And Winfield's the guy that got him out of bounds. Later. And the Chiefs are in field goal range, but Andy Reid says, no, 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 keep the offense on the field. It's first down and 10, Kansas City, tie ball game at 24-24. Well, yeah, I mean, the if, line of scrimmage is the 28. If they kick a field goal, the Bucks are yeah. going to have an opportunity to uh, get the ball. Yeah. Now the Bucks would have a chance if we hold him to a field goal. Mahomes awaits the snap. Inside handoff. Oh, he keeps the ball. Runs and slides at the 25-yard line. Boy, bad ankle and all, huh? He was limping at the end of the Las Vegas game. And he was on the injury list all week long with an ankle. It's first down and 10 from the 11-yard line. Chiefs could win with a touchdown. The snap, Mahomes hands the ball off, trying to cut back against the green. His hunt, and he makes two guys miss. He's slippery. And he gets it inside the eight-yard line to near the seven. It will be second down and about five. Second down, four and a half, five. Tampa Bay Buccaneers defense trying to control this Kansas City offense, and that's tough to do. Kansas City Chiefs have won back-to-back -back Super Bowls. We beat them in Super Bowl 55 at Raymond James Stadium. 31 to nine, they have not forgotten. They beat us the following year at home. Buccaneers will bow their necks and try to keep Kansas City out of the end zone. That's tough to do. Ask San Francisco, huh? And the overtime thriller, Super Bowl 58. Empty backfield now for Patrick Mahomes. He's dangerous. Will send Hunt in motion. Fakes the pass, throws the pass near side. Caught ball by Kelsey. Tackled short in the goal line at the three yard line. They'll give him forward progress to the two. Will that be a first down? I think he's going to be a little short. Yeah, he's going to be close. They take the spot of the ball, but they'll have it inside the three-yard line. And Travis Kelsey, as big as he is, he's 6'5", 250. And the Buc Buccaneers kept him out of the first down. Needed to get it to the one. That's his 14th catch of the game, Travis Kelsey. Coming into the game at 38 catches. Is reported as eligible. Third down and less than a yard for a first down. Third down and less than two for a touchdown. And the Chiefs have played false ball here in the second half. We're in overtime. There's the snap. Mahomes hands the ball off to Hunt. Over the right side. He has a, well, touchdown. Kansas City Chiefs. And that wins the game for the home team. Six minutes into overtime, the Chiefs go 70 yards. And a two-yard touchdown jump over the top by Kareem Hunt. And the Kansas City Chiefs have set a new franchise record with their 14th consecutive win. The only unbeaten team in the National Football League through week nine is the team that plays at Arrowhead in Kansas City, Missouri. Well, the Bucks had opportunities. You know, they weren't able to, to close it out. They fought well. Kansas City had 83 plays and the Bucks only had 52. Wow. So that's a lot. You know, that's an extra 31 plays of working on your defense and wearing them down. And you could see it at the end of this game where, you know, the Bucks just kind of ran out of gas. Well, the main factor in the second half was the running of Kareem Hunt. Well, a heartbreaking loss in overtime, our second overtime loss. By about the same thing, although Atlanta threw a touchdown pass to beat us in overtime, and this time it was Kareem Hunt over 100 yards rushing for the first time this season, I believe, and his two-yard dive over right guard gives them the winning touchdown in overtime, and fans are going to go home happy.